Are you serious? Are you serious? Iran's Revolutionary Guard leader, General Qasem Salami, uh, posted a picture of himself in front of the White House with a walkie-talkie in his hand as the White House is exploding behind him. Matter of fact, General Qasem Salami, since 1998, has commanded Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps and Extraterritorial Special Forces Unit. The Quads Force was designated by the United States Department of the Treasury in October of 2011 for connection to a plot to assassinate the Saudi ambassador to the United States Adel bin Hamad al-Jubir. You might remember when they tried to assassinate him. But earlier in May of 2011, he was also designated uh, under Executive Order 13572, which focuses on human rights abuses in Syria for his role in the Revolutionary Guard commander. And in July of 2005, under EO. Uh, Executive Order 13382, he was also uh, focused on for his relationship with the Iranian Revolutionary Guard. So in July 26th of this year, in a speech, General Qasem Salami responded to a tweet by U.S. President Donald J. Trump directed at the Iranian President Hassan Rouhani stating that President Trump has the rhetoric of a man in a casino or a bar, compared him to a gambler, and warned the United States not to threaten Iran. Salami declared, quote, Know that we are near you, in places that don't come to your mind. We are near you in places that you can't even imagine. We are a nation of martyrs. You know that a war would mean the loss of all of your capabilities. You may start the war, but we will be the ones to determine its end. This Instagram terms and conditions included a list of community guidelines which state Instagram is not a place to support or praise terrorism, organized crime, or even hate groups. We can remove any content or information you share on the service if you believe that it violates these terms, okay? Now, this was posted along with Salami's uh, statement. Salami's Instagram handle, uh, and uh, he he first posted in July 28th. At the time of this writing, he had 710 posts, over 69,000 followers of Salami um, on Instagram. Is Alex Jones on Instagram? Remember if he is, I don't, or maybe I, I don't. in a, his account bio reads: Major General in Iran, Army um, Commander, Quads Force since 1998. Links to the Telegram account. So, uh, but now in July 28th of this year, Salami posted a graphic of himself using a walkie-talkie in front of the White House as it explodes. Text on the photo reads, we will crush the United States under our feet. Salami's caption on the photo reiterates, we will crush America under our feet. And ask readers to follow the account's Telegram channel. Okay. Now on July 30th of 2018, General Salami posted a photo of himself giving a speech. The image includes a quote from Salami's July 26th speech where he says, quote, Mr. Trump, the gambler, don't threaten our lives. You are well aware of our power and capabilities in the region. You know how powerful we are in um, war. So many of uh, Salami's posts show him leading the Iranian religious military figures and other figures from Iran and Hezbollah, for example. Back in July 18th of 2018, Salami posted a photo of himself with the Iranian supreme leader, the Ali Ala uh, Khomeini, with a caption urging readers to leave positive feedbacks 
in English so that Instagram would not shut down his account. Okay. So, anyway, General Salami threatening the United States, putting on his threatening reports. This is just all part of the uh, psychological psych op, just really just psychological warfare that goes on between uh, the Iranians and the United States. And uh, it's going to continue. It's getting uglier. We're getting closer to the Psalms 83 war, uh, mainly because of Israel, because the Iranians want to annihilate Israel. Now, not all the Iranian people, of course, but we know we're dealing with the Ayatollah Ali Khomeini's regime who wants to do this. And they've said it many, many times. Now, the scripture does say in Psalms 83, Keep not thou silence, O God, hold not thy peace, and be not still, O God, for lo, thy enemies have made a turmoil. And they that hate thee have lifted up the head. They've taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. They've said, come, let us cut them off from being a nation that the name of Israel may be no more in remembrance. For they've consulted together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. Now, this has been repeatedly the words of the Iranians the regime of the Ayatollah Ali Khomeini, along with President Hassan Rouhani and others, and including this general, Qasem uh, Salami. But Salami also hates the United States with a passion, okay? He just hates us. So we'll keep an eye on what he's doing, and, and uh, we'll continue to move forward with the current um, status of what's going on. The Middle East, is, of course, is a ticking time bomb. A lot of prayer. Pray for the peace of Jerusalem. And you will prosper, okay? Pray one for another. We're in the end times. We're in the last days. You want to give your life to Jesus Christ before it's too late. Seriously. You don't want to be left behind. You don't want to be left behind. 